WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a very sunny, pleasant, and beautiful Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and we've got a mixed bag out there. The mix goes like this. The Dow's up 162, four-tenths of a percent, a quarter percent for the Russell, five points. Trendy's up 1%, 137 points there, half percent for the New York Stock Exchange. The S&P's off 12, the NASDAQ 100 is off 157, the semis are off 64 points. You've got gold up 9 bucks, silver up 21 pennies, you've got lights recruit up 49 cents, natural gas is up a penny, 30 year treasures up a half a point, printed out at 114.20. Let's figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart. We begin with the ES Mini, upper left hand side. Today, if at the session end you get a bullish amber candle, you'll have a Gartley buy pattern, a buy the D point pattern out there. And that would be uh, tell us that we should see a rally. We'll take a look at Stevie's other charts during the day to figure out our during, you know, in the next uh, session here after, after this update. Uh, to figure out where price could bounce to. That's if we get that bullish reversal candle. The NQ, really, the pattern is the same. It's made the 1 to 2, A to B equals CD pattern. Doesn't mean it has to stop there, but if at day's end it generated a bullish hammer candle, any kind of bullish reversal signal, that would be a buy the D point pattern. US dollar index still trading with inside its daily profile. It's a bearish structured profile. The range is between 106.32 at resistance, 104.71 at support. Goldilocks would negate a sell the D point pattern if price closed above 24.14. 80 out there and right now price trading above the top of its daily profile so gold is not sure what it wants to do if you take a look at silver it's got a sell the d point pattern and price consolidating with inside its profile resistance which is tested already today is up at 2902 support down at 2755 lights be crude Still trading below the bottom of its daily profile it's a bullish structure profile that bounced overnight ended up finding resistance at the center of its uh, bearish structured profile. So that suggests that we could see Lightspeed crew continue to move lower. Natural gas just trading with inside its profile. It has support at 196 and it's got resistance up at 209. In the case of the 30 year Treasury, it's got a buy the D point pattern. I uh, formed that a few uh, couple of days ago with price consolidating with inside its profile. An overnight action, price found resistance up at the top of the profile. That's at 116.10. We actually got up to 116.05. So that's the overview of the equity future contracts, of the uh, metals out there, of the U.S. dollar index. And I want everybody to have just simply a fabulous and fantastic weekend out there. But stay tuned for the Trader's Edge Show, if you would. We'll go through these charts in more detail and, of course, anything that you'd like to take a look at as well. Have a fabulous day, folks. Thanks for joining us.